doing professional development workshops for undergraduates for a couple years now. And so we had decided we would do this this year as well. And when COVID-19 pandemic happened, I think we were actually thinking along the same lines separately before we came together. Because when we came together, we almost all had the same idea. We have to continue this. We want to do this virtually. Um, no matter what it takes, let's pull our team together. Let's get them organized. Let's do this well. One of the things we've enjoyed about it is having a weekly workshop to bring students together to create community in person, you know, to, to build that network by being in the same room at the same time. And so we were taken aback at the inability to do that this summer, but have appreciated that community building part of these programs over the years and knew that we couldn't drop it entirely. Yeah. And it really was a Herculean effort on all of our parts. And I was just so impressed with so many people on our team for, for coming through and, and showing up in ways that we hadn't expected them to. They didn't sign up for, you know, none of them signed up for this. We didn't sign up for this, but we all came through because we shared a common goal of wanting to help students and engage students and, uh, you know, get them through this. For me coming into it uh, for the first time, I think it's really opened up so many more avenues, specifically in research that I didn't even know existed. For example, like, um, like ResearchGate or like these different social networks so specifically tailored for academic research and just really helped me um, hold my writing skills that I was severely lacking, <laughs> if I had to put it simply. Anytime if I have questions and I feel like um, any assignment was challenge me. I spend more time to study out of out of the hours. So I feel like I'm, I'm learning for myself. Isn't isn't really not like a work, and I appreciate the opportunity. And it's it's a great amazing experiences.